Uh, back to Castle Black. So am I a ranger now? Last I saw, I was doing training. You can't be fighting with the other recruits. You need oh, those right. men to have your back. Oh, come on! There's I stood up. There's enough here trying to kill us without trouble amongst our own. You're, You're right. right. I'm sorry. Sorry, Jon Snow. So I'm now. Married. Frostfinger told me about you. Seems to think you might be trouble. Yeah, <laughs> probably trouble. Oh, uh, he might be right. Might be right. He said worse about me. All right. So we're going up to the top of the wall now. This will be really interesting. Fought for the north with the foresters. Yeah. You were that's there. right. But the twins. Yep. Yes. I still don't understand. Three thousand men, and not one could save my brother. Well, they were all invited to the wedding. Why didn't anyone fight back? Why didn't they rally to their king? Ambushed. Nobody was expecting it. One minute we were drinking and telling jokes, and, and the next... The phrase cut us open. Oh, good. Those cowards. Couldn't face Rob like men, so they stabbed him in the back. Yep. That's what they did. They it was terrible. give him an honorable death. Let him die fighting. Ah, uh, we'll make them Walter pay. Walter Frey and Roos Bolton will pay for their treachery. I'd like to believe you, but men like that don't get what they deserve. Oh, they do. Eventually. Now the Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are Wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. Well, things are always fair in this world. They murdered my family. I should have been there. Probably would have died too, though, really. I keep thinking if I'd been there, I could have done something. But chances are, I'd be dead too. Exactly. I once thought, That's what I, I was saying. Here, with the nice watch. Man, this, this wall is so tall. Ah, there we go. Sweet. Be cool if we get to do a little bit of archery from up here. Is anybody else up here? There are those here who will hate you for who you are. Southerners who will call what? you traitor. Northerners who will call you craven. Some <laughs> won't even have a reason. They'll hate you anyway. You can't do anything about it. Sounds about right, considering all the people Trust that are me, up here. I know. Uh, just, I don't care, I guess. I don't care if they hate me. Let them think what they like. Ignoring them won't be as easy as you think. Ah, we'll see. Most of the men are criminals, forced to take the black. You were a squire for a noble house. What happened to you today happened to me more times than I can count. I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. Okay, I just need to find some. I guess it was that one guy that stole the dagger oh. I guess I could trust. He seemed friendly-ish. Oh, look at that view. Let's get up there. And not push Jon Snow off the edge. Can we try? No, I can't. <laughs> wow. I felt the same first time I saw it. That was a pretty nice view. I heard you want to be a ranger. Why? why I don't remember why. Out there? Uh, to find the North... Oh, I can't mention that. Oh my gosh. I want to protect House Forrester. You'll protect them by doing your duty here. Hmm. Not many recruits want to be rangers. They'd rather stay here where they think they'll be warm and safe. But Mance well. Raider marches on the wall with a hundred thousand wildlings. I've seen them for myself. The oh, is this? Murderers, thieves, rapers. Hmm. You won't like most of them, and they won't like you. But they're your brothers now. Can you stand with them? Yes. Can I'll you do what is necessary. If you ask it, here we if go. You ask me to, <laughs> I will. Glad to hear it. I guess I better do what John says. I'd say you'll get used to the cold, but you won't. Come on. Better get by a fire, or you'll end up like Frostfinger. We need pockets on these outfits. Then our hands won't be so cold, or at least gloves. I mean, come on. No people with no gloves. That's crazy.
Oh, now we get to go down to the garden. Man, this game jumps around a lot, doesn't it? <laughs> so now we're down at the garden uh, to meet whoever left the mysterious message for me. Which I kind of feel like is probably the same person that also ransacked my room. Let's see. Who's it going to be? Cold Boy, I'm, I'm guessing. Where are you? Let's have a little look around. Not supposed to be out at night time. Please don't be a monster. <gasps> ah, ha, 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 ha. You made me jump. Little rustling leaves. There's nobody here. Come on. Who could it have been? And it's crows. Oh. Is that a guard or is that the guy who left me the message? Because I don't know who that is. Can't quite tell from this distance. Might be a guard. Call out to. I'm not calling out to them. Are you kidding me? It's probably uh Where do you oh. think you're going? Hi! <laughs> At this time of night. Uh I'm meeting I'm someone. Meeting someone. So Why did I say that? Out, isn't it? Do Sorry. You know what this uniform means? It means you're a guard? It means you serve the Lannisters. So you best get yourself back to your chambers. And I mean now. But I, I didn't like get to... it. You can take it up with the commander. Is can I change no your mind change somehow? Your mind? Did you not hear me? Please don't kill me. Please, Lucan. Oh. The lady is with me. Oh. Yes. Wow. So, okay. Enjoy your night. So that was the guy that we were going to meet. I'm not I sure who it's supposed to be. You, my lady. I'm Damien. Damien, what? <laughs> uh, 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 th uh, did you, you write the, the note? Room earlier. Did you leave me this note? I did. Damien. I'm in the game. I'm very glad you could make it. I was not expecting that. To you for quite some time. Hmm. Did you? Were you the did one that searched my room? my room? What were you looking for? You could have tied it up after yourself. I only wish to leave you a note. Hmm. Then why did you take the letters from my family? Was that somebody else? Two people I raided my room at the same time? Mira, but you've <sighs> made enemies of the wrong people. What? How? The handmaiden should know her place. Who? What people? I'll make this quick if that helps. Wait, what? To see you suffer. Wait, what? No, 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 no! <gasps> Damien! <laughs> You're, you're, you're a murderer! He's an assassin! He's a very good assassin, I gotta say. It's just, just like Damien. There we go. No dagger for you. Oh no! He pulled me to the dagger! No, Damien, please! <laughs> Why? Oh! Cold boy! No, not the cold boy! Save him, save him. Right now. Get up, save the cold boy. Oh my gosh. What's with the slowdown? I can attack him, jeez. I don't want the cold boy to die. Yeah, in the belly. Sorry, Damien. Oh, oh, my gosh. There could be only one Damien. <laughs> You're right, kiddo. You? I saved you. What, what, what happened? Wait, were you the one that wrote the note? Mm, he tried to kill me. Like? He tried to kill me. Why would he do that? I don't know, because he's a bad guy. What are you doing here? I heard yelling. Are you supposed to be in bed? Oh my gosh. <laughs> no sooner do I meet a Damien than I kill him. Do, it's hilarious. You had no choice. I need to get back. Someone might Actually, I did have a choice. I didn't want the cold boy to die. No one will ever find him. Uh, good luck. Good luck, and be careful. Thanks. Wow. What about all the blood? Oh, there's Everything no blood. Right, cool. <gasps> oh, oh, oh! Just running with a dagger in my Damn hand, you. with blood on my Where face. I'm here. <laughs> uh, ditch the weapon, would ya? Throw it over the edge. Toss it. Well, not there. Oh, idiot. <laughs> Keeping the knife would have been a bad idea, I'm sure of it. But I, would, I would have tossed it over the edge of the castle or something. 
Oh, time for the funeral. Poor Nathan and his dad, who I forgot the name of. Yeah. Oh, she came too. A weird time to ask, but will you marry me? <laughs> no idea. Oh, wait, no, this is a different person. Oh. Sir Roland, it's been a while since we've met. Yes. Last time I saw you, you and my brother had almost started a war. No. Your father wanted to murder Asher for your little love affair, remember? Oh. That was a long time ago. This is the girl that Asher fell in love with. Privately. And she's from the White Hills. That's why. That's why it was a problem. Roger, that's why he had to leave. I came here because. I know how hard these past few days must have been for you and your family. It's like a real Romeo and Juliet story. I know my words probably mean nothing to you. Thank you. Ah, oh, thank you. I'm so sorry, Roderick. Your brother didn't deserve this. No. Neither of them did. Listen. I know my father is intent on using Ryan as a hostage, but I think you deserve some news of him. Sure. I know it's little consolation, but if I can offer you this... So you have news of Ryan? Yes. I've just realized that Ryan is the youngest brother. Not happy, but Maybe I should have kissed his ring. At high point. Dang. I'm looking after him, but... What? The other day he said something that made me worry. He asked me if his father died because he was a coward. He asked if he was really a thief and a traitor, like my father says. Oh my gosh. They're being really, you, really but... mean to little kid. Little Ryan. I thought you should know. <sighs> Please, Please help him. help him, Gwyn. Don't let him believe what your father tells him. I've been doing my best to set him right. But he is only a child. He feels oh. forgotten. Alone. He's Poor waiting kid. for his family, but every day my father tells him they will never come. That they've chosen their pride over him. I will I'll bring him, him home. Back. He'll be with his family again. You tell him that. Of course. But if you truly want to bring Ryan home, this war has to end. You know that. Well, we just we need to, to get an army. Roderick. Hello, Gwyn. <clears throat> it's oh. good to see you, Talia. She's not happy. I hope I can count on your discretion. Man. Roderick, what a mess. You should speak to Mother. I don't think there'll ever be peace between the forests and the White Hills, though. So it's gonna have to come Mother, to a battle. Come join the others. He should be here. He should be with his family. But instead, they send her. <sighs> she can help. Gwyn may be able to help us. I it's don't think Mother believes me. I can see it. My father's house was once mighty like this one. But his loyalty to the Targaryens cost us dearly. I watched as countless of our kin fell, saw our lands destroyed, everything we clung to was ripped from our hands. Hmm. I can't watch that same fate before this family. Our house. My we'll children. Manage. I won't, I won't let, let it happen. That happen to us. You must be ready to defend us, Roderick. Absolutely. Your body may be damaged, but your spirit must be like iron. You let nothing stand in your way, do you understand? Oh, if you tell me to, to be ruthless now. Last White Hill down to the babes in their beds. <laughs> no matter what you Mother. must do. Promise My me. gosh, you'll go you'll crazy go thinking me, things like that. I have seen what men must do to win a war. You must be ready. Promise me. We will be ready, Mother. I'm not killing babies, though. Vera, Asher, even Garrett. They all stand with us. We are what? strong. Somebody behind me? Yes. I suppose we have to be. You'll be okay. I have a feeling things will turn out okay in the end. Would you say a few words, my lord? Yeah. At least I don't have to choose the words I'm going to say at the family funeral, because that's too sad. Oh no, I do have to choose them. <laughs> I thought it was going away. No. Oh. Poor daddy. My father. He, he was everything. Everything I ever wanted to be. Apart from dead. He showed me what it is to be a lord. He was honorable. He was honorable. I never knew a better man. And I am. 
I am sorry. I love your father. Oh, what we can say about the Eva, little brother. My little brother. He, he saved Tali's life. He did. He saved our sister's life and paid with his own. He was only a boy. But now we are the Lord. We honor Lord Gregor Forrester. My husband, my love, and our Lord Ethan. My sweet <sighs> little boy. Sad that he died. But now is time to say goodbye. What's she giving them? Father and son are returned to the earth, to the ice. And from their sacrifice, new life begins. Iron from ice. Iron, Iron from, from ice. ice. No. This weird blue fire that we have to use to light the ironwood. Oh. Oh my gosh, I gotta I gotta light the fire myself. Guess it doesn't really matter which order I do it in, right? This is not favoritism. I'm just going left to right because it's normal. <laughs> uh, funerals, eh? Do you have to walk between them like that? What's going on? Oh, the song. Right. From highs, from highs, we forced us born. To ice we all return Father, brother, I've sworn, I've sworn To guard this rest you've earned I'd bear my neck to will in pain And swim That's a very poignant song. Jeez. <sighs> I think that's the end of the episode, though. Yeah. Wow, guys. Uh, I guess we'll just take a quick look at what's coming up. What is going on? Roderick, oh, the White Hill soldiers. Lord Whitehill's son has arrived. Griff Whitehill what's he going to do? Torment us. Nothing worse than a fourthborn with something to prove. Great. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof. He's gonna turn them all Form against us. And follow my lead. You'll be taking your vows. You too, right. Tuttle. Time to start proving you're a brother. All right, that's cool. You know, take uh, oh, our vows get sworn in. I wonder sometimes if it's worth it. All the sacrifices. Enjoy the wedding. How much oh, the, the wedding's going to be next episode. Sweet. If the Lost Legion doesn't catch up to us first. No. I overheard a couple of men whispering about the 
Lannister guard. The question oh. people. Is there anything else we need to be worried about? No, not if you hit the body. And I got rid of the dagger, so. The heck, is that a dragon? Jeez. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, looks like pretty much for all the decisions there, I was in the majority, so. That makes me feel better. Gosh, only 4.5% of people did, uh, didn't stand up to Carter after he stole Finn's knife. Wow. That is a very small percent. I wonder what would happen if he did or did not, I guess. Uh, but anyway, guys, that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. And tune in next time where we'll continue with Game of Thrones Episode 3. <laughs> Take care, guys. Bye. Next time on Game of Thrones. Oh, no. I just had a thought. Is there a dragon in here? That looks like a dragon tooth. Maybe it's like an old dragon cave and the dragon's dead. Oh, no.